Hey everyone, Miss Scarlet Tanager here, and it's been about a year, it's December now, which means it's time for another Project for Awesome. This year, I chose a charity to do for Project for Awesome based on my own past, just like I did last year, and I have something here that I would really like to show you guys. These are seven photos. This is a picture of my dad reeling in a fish. This is a picture of my parents together. This is a picture of my father with my little brother. This is a picture of my dad. My dad with my grandma and my brother. My dad and my brother fishing. And another of my dad and my father fishing. The reason why I'm showing you these photos is these seven photos are the only pictures of my father that I have and not a single one of them shows the two of us together. The reason for that is when I was 16 years old, so about 7 years ago, my father was diagnosed stage 4 metastasized lung cancer. Technically he was diagnosed when I was 15 years old. I came back from school one day to be told that he was in the emergency room because he had collapsed at work. Within about a week or so, we got the diagnosis. Cancer had spread throughout his entire body. It was in his bones, it was in his brain, it was in his lungs, his hip, everywhere. Within a year, a couple months after my 16th birthday, in April, my father died. Before that, he had had a stroke caused by the cancer on one side of his brain, which knocked out the entire use of the left side of his body. Some of the last memories I have of my father are of him in hospice care, dying in a bed, unable to move the entire left side. So because of that, for Project for Awesome this year, I wanted to do mine for the Cancer Research Institute. They do a lot of work in cancer prevention and new therapies and things that help people like my father so they get early screenings, early detection, and have treatment options they might not have previously. The thing about cancer is that the cells in your body, when they turn cancerous, they ignore signals that tell them to stop dividing. They stop undergoing something called apoptosis, which is when cells reach a certain age, the body tells them to destroy themselves so they can't get too damaged. This didn't happen with my father. And because of that, I am 23 years old, and my father is in a small cremated box in a military cemetery. These seven pictures are the only photos I have of him. Not a single one is of the two of us together. And that is not something that anybody should have to go through. One of these photos, this one, it shows my grandmother, my father, and my brother together. Less than a month after my father died, my grandmother died of the same thing. Metastasized stage 4 lung cancer. In the link below, I'm going to put a link to the Cancer Research Institute where you guys can donate if you can. Share this video out so we can get some awareness on this. And I'll put the link to the Project for Awesome page where you guys can vote on this video to get it raised up in the Project for Awesome rankings and hopefully get some of the money for the Cancer Research Institute because they really deserve it in order to stop things like me not having a single picture of me and my father together. 